Hey everybody, welcome to Musical Reviews with Mr. B, where we review the ideas that we talked about in our musical instrument lessons. Today's review is on the types of simple meter. In a previous video, we talked about the difference between meter and time. Basically, we said that time is about the way music looks, what's written in the music, and that's symbolized by time signatures. But meter is about how music feels, the strong and weak pulses and patterns that we feel in the music. We're going to talk about different types of meters today, specifically simple meters. There's three types of simple meters. The first is duple meters, and that has to do with the number two. Triple meter has to do with the number three, and quadruple meter has to do with the number four. Let's jump in with duple meter. Again, that has to do with the number two. I'm gonna show you a pattern across the screen here, some stars, and I'm gonna tell you that it's a repeated pattern. That means there's a certain number of pieces in our pattern, and then that pattern repeats over and over again. How many stars are in the pattern that repeats across the screen? That's right, there's two stars, a big star and a little star. That's our pattern. Then that pattern repeats, big star, little star. Then the pattern repeats again and again across the page. Duple meter says there's two pieces in your pattern, and then the pattern repeats across the screen. Let's show that with numbers now. Instead of showing two stars, we're counting one, two. That's our pattern, one, two. And then that pattern repeats across the screen. One, two, one, two, one, two. Now, you'll notice that the number ones are larger or stronger than the number twos, which are smaller or weaker, we would say. Uh, we use strong pulses to show that our pattern is beginning again. The pattern begins with number one. So every time we say one, we're going to have a strong or louder pulse or sound so that we know and feel that pattern beginning again. It would sound like this. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Did you notice that my ones were stronger and my twos were weaker? The stronger pattern, the stronger one, let you know that the pattern was beginning over again. Can you say that with me? Make sure your ones are stronger and your twos are weaker. Here we go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. That's duple meter. When we have two pieces in our pattern that repeats throughout the music and that is shown by the time signature, for example, two, four. That top number two shows us that there are two pieces in the pattern that repeats throughout the music. That's duple meter. Let's move on to triple meter, and that has to do with number three. Triple meter, number three. We'll put our pattern of stars across the screen again. You've already seen the difference, haven't you? Now our pattern has three pieces. That's what triple meter is. It's a pattern with three pieces. Big star, little star, little star. And then that pattern repeats across the page. Let's put our numbers down here. You know what's going to happen. We're going to count to three this time. Once again, to show that our pattern is beginning over again, our one is always stronger than our two and three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Say it with me. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. That pattern, triple meter, is usually shown by a time signature of three, four. That top number three showing that there are three pieces to the pattern that repeat throughout our music. That's triple meter. Now we're in quadruple meter. Yes, you're right. That's the number four. Here's our star pattern. You already know what it'll be before I even show it. Now we have four pieces to our pattern. And our numbers count up to four this time. Once again, our ones are stronger so that we show and feel that our pattern is beginning again. I don't think I need to say this to you first before you say it with me. Let's just do it together. Ready? Begin. One two, three, 
four. One, two, three, four. That stronger number one helps us to feel the pattern beginning over again. That's quadruple meter, and it's shown most times by a 4-4 four, four time signature. The top number four telling us there are four pieces in our repeated pattern throughout the song. So that's our review of simple meters, and the three types are duple meter, having to do with the number two, triple meter, three pieces in our pattern, and a four-piece pattern is called quadruple meter. Well, that completes our review of the types of simple meter. Thanks again for tuning in to Musical Reviews with Mr. B. We look forward to seeing you again soon.